I don't know if the game wants me to spend like a specific. Wait, there's a soft story here? Rumor loving hostess. Hey, have you heard the legends about the cabaret killer? Oh shit! Totally, they say they only goes after number one hostesses. How scary is that? Are they talking about me? Legend goes, she used to be on top of the entertainment world. She had money, she had men. Nothing stood in her way. Okay, no. Till one day, the number two at her club couldn't take it anymore and mutilated her face with a butcher's knife. Fucking whoa. With no future in entertainment, she took the only path she saw forward and killed herself. What happened then? Her ghost came back and started hunting down hostesses at the cabaret as the cabaret killer. I, I don't think I'm going to be able to sleep at night after this. <laughs> you don't have anything to worry about. It's just an urban legend. Besides, she only goes after number one hostesses. Oh, right. <laughs> I guess it was getting all worked up for nothing there. I hope. Sorry for scaring you. The cabaret killer, huh? Oh my god, what the fuck is this? What is this sub story? I want to see how this develops. Where do I where do I go for it? Where's the next point in the cabaret killer storyline? I mean, I'm probably just gonna walk around and something's gonna trigger. But I probably need to walk into a specific phone call. Okay. This is Kiryu. It's me. I just finished up my preparations. Can you swing by Tarana when you get the chance? There's something I need to say before Sayama gets back into town. Alright. Okay. That guy just walked through me. Let's go to a pawn shop. Also, I see this soft story marker. Okay. We got here. Hello. What would it be today? Let's, I'm here to buy a knife. What does she want? Does she want a Chinese cleaver? Or no, it, I, I feel it would probably be a weapon, right? I really wanted that knife. Okay, sure. I'll buy a knife. Um, I need to get dispose of one of my things, so. I, I can get rid of this fucking gun. It doesn't have any more bullets. I'm here to buy. I mean, do you have. I mean, this is a saw, it's not a knife. This is a Chinese cleaver. Lampstead, bulletproof. I mean, I am buying a Chinese cleaver? That's not what she wants, is it? Thanks, Uncle Cass, I make some tasty food with this. Okay, you got a Chinese cleaver, Haruka. Okay, two more. Okay, I see the soft story marker though, so I'll go do that. What's happening here? Oh, this does this soft story trigger specifically because Herrick is with me? Ah! Someone help me! Shit! Uncle Gus, you have the saber! Let her go! <sighs> Ugh, she ran away. Come on, Kiryu. Hey, are you okay? The, the cabaret killer is gonna get me any day now. What are you talking about? Remember, Uncle Cass? That's the ghost that goes after number one hostesses. That wasn't a ghost. That was a real person. Um, what's your name? It's Yuka. I work as a hostess at a place called Club Bidal just a little up ahead. I was just on my way to work when she attacked me. I could have sworn the whole thing was just an urban myth, but now, what am I gonna do? She she'll kill me! First things first, you need to calm down. We're here to help. Okay. Is Haruka searching for clues? Doing a little better now? Y yeah but still, I was so scared. Yuki-chan! No! You look like you just saw a ghost! Are you okay? Yeah, I think it'll be all right. Can you walk? I think so. Hey, mister, um, I don't know how, but I want to repay you for saving my life. Can we meet up later? Here, that's my phone number. If you want. Are you sure you're okay? I bet you anything, the other hostess on the screen, I forgot her name, Yuka or whatever, that's the, that's the killer. 
Yeah, I'm sure. Thanks again. No, the other guy. Now she's the, she now is the one that was here. Come on, Yuka. We gotta go. That that is the person that tried to stab her or whatever. It's now. Mm, something smells. Mm -hmm. I don't smell anything. It smells like mystery, Uncle Cass. Oh my god, she's like, let's solve the mystery, Uncle. Let's go to Vidal and see if we can figure out what happened here. Alright, I guess it wouldn't hurt to take a look. I love Hargus so much. Like, this is like the best... Like, this is like the best example I can think of. Like, a dumb child that becomes like a consistent. And it's actually like a character that you love so much. It's Haruka. It's the only one I can think of. Because usually it's just like an element of like you gotta protect this kid or whatever. But Haruka is such a like strong character. Oh, you're the one who saved Yuka-chan. Thanks again for that. It was nothing. Where is she now? I tried to make her go home and rest after what happened, but she said she had to meet a customer and well, she's been out since. Strange, but okay. Hey, speaking of Yuka-chan. Mm -hmm. I think somebody has a grudge against her. That's why she got attacked. What? Yeah, there's this guy that comes to her all the time. Her, his name is Katsumi. Katsumi-san gives her all sorts of fancy presents and stuff, but recently he found out she has a boyfriend. So you think he might have been... So you think he might have been attacking her out of jealousy? I don't know if he would go that far. Maybe her boyfriend know, would know more, though. He's a host of a stardust. I'm pretty sure his name is Hikaru-kun. From what Yuka-chan tells me, things actually haven't been going well with the two of them. They apparently fight pretty often. I'm just so worried about Yuka Chen. I really should be getting back to work though. Please let me know the moment you find anything, okay? Oh, and thanks again. Uh, of course. Okay, mystery time. Let's go to Stardust. Alright, we have two suspects the weird client Katsumi Sen and Yuka Chen's boyfriend, Hikaru Kun. Yeah, that Hikaru guy is working to Stardust. Yeah, but like the person we saw was the woman, so. We should go ask you if he knows anything. Yep. Okay. This sounds fun. Oh, we're just here now. Hey there, Kitty Zen. How's the gang gang? Not bad. I have a question for you, though. Is there a Hikaru working here tonight? You bet. Hold on. Let me grab him. Hey, Hikaru-kun. You got a minute? Of course, sir. What's up? My buddy Kitty Zen has some business with you. I'll let you two hash things out, Kitty Zen. Just all if you need anything, yeah? Will do. Sorry to interrupt your work. <laughs> She's a fucking dog. <laughs> so you're Hikaru. I hear you've been seeing a hostess named Yuka-chan from a Bidal. Y yeah, what's it to you? Have you been eating alone lately? Uh, huh? The hell did that come from? One of Yuka's friends told us she overheard you two arguing. It sounded pretty bad from how she put it. <laughs> <laughs> that That's what you came here to talk about. Our little squalors are a daily thing. Oh yeah? Totally! Whenever a little thing goes wrong, she gets all melodramatic and starts saying she wants to break a break with me. She she don't mean it though. I, in fact, uh, we're we're in love. I'm, I'm actually saving up some doves so I can ask her to marry me. Hmm. <laughs> you gotta promise me, man. Keep it secret from Yuka Chan, okay? I don't want her to come hear it coming from me. I want her to hear, hear it coming from me, sorry. I can do that. Thanks a ton. A anyway, I hope you get it back to my table. Later. That doesn't sound like a functional relationship, bro. It really doesn't. Mm. That's one suspect cross off the list. I mean, no. That guy didn't sound healthy. Okay. Now what? Phone call. Okay. Hmm. Hello? Hello, this is Yuka from Bidal. Thank you so much for earlier, mister. Of course. How do you get my number? I wanted something to make it up to you, but I gotta meet up with one of my clients first. Then you can wait up until after? Hold on a second. Are you going to see a man named Katsumi? Huh? How do you know? It's a long story. Where are you now? Just passing by Kodobuki Drug. Should, should, I'm gonna be late. I'll get, I'll get in touch with you later, okay? Haruka, are you, are you thinking what I'm thinking? Yeah, I'm thinking I'm thinking too. She said she was passing to go to Buki Drugs. This seems like the best place to start. Okay. Where's Kudu Buki Right there. Yeah? Yeah, okay. Let's go. Like, I know I want to do main story, but listen, man. 
we just walk into a really interesting sub story so let's go this is priority number one now Soft toys are so fucking fun in this game franchise, they really are. Right here. Oh, this is an old man. Hey. Oh, kitty san Stay away from you, kill old man. Or should I say cabaret killer? Who the hell are you? And why are you basically accusing me of some murder nonsense? <laughs> Hold on, Kiryu-san. Katsumi-san doesn't have to do anything with this. What are you talking about? I was just planning on giving this lovely girl here a little present. Hmm. You better not be lying to me. He's not. Katsumi-san. He's my boyfriend's dad. What? Yuka-chan here is always going above and beyond to look after my idiot son. Every so often to give her presents to thank her. That's why we were meeting up today. Oh, and I picked this back, Alice, and nobody would see us and get the wrong idea. Hmm, so then the cavalry killer. I mean, we, we saw a woman, like. Oh, sorry. I should probably answer that. It's it's the other hostess. Hey, Uncle Cass. Hmm? I cracked the case. I know who did it. Really? Sorry, that was now. Yeah, it's now. She wants me to, uh, she wants me... She wants to walk me to work. I think she's been really worried about me lately. Well, I should get going. Thanks again for the present, Katsumi-san. And Kitty-san, I really appreciate the hard work you and Harika Chan have worked for me. See you. Alright, Haruka. Let's hear who the killer is. Based on everything that's happened, I'm pretty sure it's... Ah! Yeah, of course. Yuka. Uncle Cass, just in danger. We gotta hurry. Let's go. Yeah, it's... yes. It's fucking now. Now, son, stop! Now, son? What are you talking about? I know... I, I like that he called it, like, right away. I like that he called it, like, the right away. Because the way sub stories work is that if you see a character that shows up for the sub story, that means the character matters, right? And there's no reason for now to show up if she wasn't gonna matter later. The first time the cavalry killer showed up, she dropped this! <gasps> it's a really strong perfume. I've been tracking the smell the whole time. The first person I smelled on it was now san But our two main suspects, Hikara-san and Katsumi-san, were totally clean. That leaves only one conclusion. You are the cabaret killer now san I mean, the cabaret killer is probably just like a myth that she made up. She wants to... She wants to just kill Yuka or whatever. No, it was really you now. I don't understand. Why are you doing this? <laughs> I want a revenge. Huh? You just stole into Vidal, shut up the charts to number one, and even stole away my crush, Hikaru. Like, theme of sad Yakuza. Running that pretty bitch face of yours was the only way I could get back at you. And with all these rumors going around the cavalry killer, I thought I had the perfect cover. Um, I'm so sorry. <laughs> no. Jeez, this girl's scarier than any damn ghost I could ever be. Get up. There's a cell down at the police station with your name on it. What? Just, just, okay. Just, okay. She's just gonna walk. Theme of... Theme of... Theme of melod melodramatic Yakuza. I don't believe it. No. I can't thank you enough, my diminutive, diminutive detective. <laughs> yeah, all in a day's work. Thank you, Kiryu-san. This is as much, but please take it. Don't you be, you have been a great help. Heavenly br Beast's Bracelet. What the fuck is that? See, Uncle Cass, I told you something smelled. Good work, Haruka. That's some nose you got. Uncle Cass, you think maybe someday I can be a real detective? Uh. No doubt. You'll be the best private eye camera I've ever seen. <laughs> I wonder what my next big game will be. She's smelling. Man, that was such a good soft story. I mean, the resolution of the mystery wasn't that great, but the fact that Haruka is like, yeah, I'm solving the mystery. That's so good. I love that. I love that so much. I really do. Okay. Now. Main story time. Let's do it.
We should eat something while we're in here. Man, I already finished this place, I think, though. What about this one? Have I finished this one? No, not that. Have I finished it? I did finish it, actually. Well, whatever. Just eat everything. I need some health. Everything, everything puts me over. Damn it. Well, whatever. Okay, now let's go. God damn it, let's go. Fight. I really wish the Sotan Boy fight music was a thing in Kamurocho. Because it's such a good fight theme. Okay, I took out everyone. There's just this guy left. Come at me. Thank you, Rob. Let's go. What do you need, Data san? Oh? But this is the guy from the first game, right? Yeah, the guy with the glasses. I remember him. I think we can trust him, so maybe he... He helped to see the CD? Okay, alone. I hope she doesn't get kidnapped! What did we find? Please. Okay, he analyzed it for us. Please tell me they are brothers. Please tell me they're siblings. Please tell me they're siblings. Please, they are siblings. They're siblings. I called it. This is so. Yeah. They are half her, half siblings. Yes. Are we going to try to hide it from her? Yeah, but she already knows. Okay. So, how is this going to go? Yes, that is the question. We defused them. He's gonna lie. Mm, he's lying. And we're not gonna tell her. Gordio <sighs> She wants to know what we're gonna do with Yuji. Mm-hmm. How do you feel about this? The Millennium Tower? Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh. I mean, I was thinking the Millennium Tower, but... Uh, mm -hmm. 
私は不敬四課の主任よ殺し合いをしに行く人間を見過ごすことなんてできないわ今になって何を言ってるんだうんうんただ私は警察の人間として言ってるだけよ Please, why are, why are none of you wanting to be honest for like a second? She doesn't want her brother and Kiryu to fight and like kill each other, maybe. What are we doing? What is she doing? She's lying. I think she's lying. She's doing some bullshit. Alright, head to Tokyo PD. Police headquarters. Yeah, the chief said he'd be waiting in archive room 13 at the third floor basement. What the hell? You know the place, that the sun? I guess you could say that. Alright, archive room 13, right? Yep, thanks. If you head into Tokyo PD, I'll go with you. I know the place, it's probably better that way. Yeah, thanks. Okay. Are we... I think a cab to Tokyo PD, not my favorite destination, but... I mean, can we literally just go to the fucking police station? Can we just waltz in and just go to a room and watch shit? Like... What is there, though? We need to talk to... Besho san I think that's what she said. Sorry. Okay, so let's just take the taxi. I wonder if we have Datis and Heat moves, though. That's what something I'm wondering. Do we? No, we. We just really have counter hit moves, I think. I don't see any problems. Oh! <laughs> one of my favorite hit moves. I forgot about that one. I was not expecting that one. Good job, lady. Thank you. Oh my god. I didn't see a random lady just walking in. It's such a good heat move. Please. Okay. Oh, double heat move. Hell yeah. Good job, that the sun. Kill this man. Dead. Only this guy left. Die. I was gonna tiger drop him and that sun interrupted him. Tiger drop, dead. Okay, we're good. Let's go. Police station, isn't it? Archive room 13. Police headquarters, okay. Okay. So there's a... Yeah, she was acting weird. There's some meme that I've seen of Kiryu and Dada watching a video, and it might be from here. Like where Kiryu slams the table. And I'm, I'm waiting for it to, to see it, because as it... Yeah, it's this room! Yeah, 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 this is the meme place. This is what I was thinking. I don't know what they see, but I know that uh, is when Kira slams the table and, and walks away. What are we gonna see? What the fuck is this? Okay, it's her recording. She's gonna do something stupid, isn't she? Of course. She's gonna fucking die. She's not gonna make it past this game. She's gonna do something stupid. 
She's gonna go and try and face Ryuji on her own and he's gonna kill her. Okay. Yeah, we already know what it said. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So she was lying, they know. Yeah, the kid was Ryuji. Mm -hmm. So what is she gonna do? It's not just a Yakuza, it's a big boy, like... She's gonna go talk to him and she's gonna get killed. Fuck my life, that's exactly what's gonna happen. <sighs> if she makes it through this game, I'm gonna be shocked. I like that she's recording this as like, I'm going to die, essentially. やっぱり私とあなたは住む世界が違うんだもの。心を許した私がいけなかったのよ。それだけ。あなたは素敵だった。ごめん。笑顔で別れようと思ったのに。あなたの言う通り。宿命から逃げずに生きてゆくね。Yeah, slam the table. Sayama. I feel exactly the same way. I love how hard he slammed that door too. Okay, sad end of chapter. Just gonna go and fucking die. Chapter 16, decision. Let's go. I think we both know where Sayama went. Uh. Yeah, Kamurocho Hills. You're going, aren't you? Yeah, it's time to put an end to this. You're right, once Yuji goes taken care of, the fighting stops. But that means he's got nothing to lose. He'll fight you with everything he's got. You better be ready uh. for that. I know. Come see me before you go. And take your time getting ready. Okay, this sounds like... it's. This sounds like this is the end of game prompt. Controlling the heavens. Sup, it's Kuiwami Bob. Ever look at the sky and thought, I wish I w it, w it wasn't so bright? Well, good news. You can use the waiting room at the door in Sereno and the sofa uh, or in Aoi to change the time of day. Keep in mind, some main story events will keep you from changing the time. Use these establishments to switch between day and night as you please. Some events only happen at night, so we should explore both times a day. It's weird that... Make final preparations, this is it. Yeah, okay. So they're... They are telling me... This is the end of the game. Anything you want to do before you finish the game, do it right now. So I'm going to do that, actually. Maybe there will be some sub-story we're going to walk into, but... I'm not expecting to do any. I honestly just... just. I think I already finished everything. Haven't I? Oh, I need to get this. I don't have enough experience for it. Green experience is the one we're lacking the most. I don't know how to get it. Anyway. Let's eat something. Um, oh, we're actually kind of full. Have I finished this place? I have. So I'm gonna go buy energy drinks. Um, where's the... There we go. Go to Boogie Drugs. Let's go over there. Let's go buy energy drinks. We're gonna need them. And I remember when it was 88 and I used to own like half the city. 
Those were the days. Like I just saw the NY hot dog and I was like, oh yeah, I used to own that place. It's fucking funny that like that used to be a thing and then the game is like, yeah, like don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. J Kiryu lost the real estate. J J he just lost all of it. J don't think about it. It's fine. Drugstore. You can find me while I'm in the drugstore. Two of these, five of these, one of these, one of these, three of these, four of these. Okay, we can get that. Sure. Okay, we bought everything. Actually, I should... I should, like... I should get this and then buy another one. Right? That would be the smart thing to do. Okay, we're out. And I'm gonna do it. Let's do it. I already did all the the the, the main sub stories. I've finished Magic My Construction. I have finished Glove for Shine Gaiden. We're done. At some point, the video game has to end. It's like weird whenever that happens, you know? The feeling of I'm about to finish the video game. To me, that's always weird. Because, like... Is that a new Warish man? That's a new Warish man. Can you take a drop him? To me, that's always weird. Because it's like... The same happened to me in, like, Zelda Breath of the Wild. No, you don't. I want to take a drop him. Well, fuck it. Die. The same happened to me in Solo Breath of the Wild, where literally I never beat that game, but like I did everything. I got a katana. I did everything in that game, and then when the game literally just told me go and defeat the final boss i was like i don't want to because i don't want the game to end there's something there's a weird feeling to like i don't want the game to end and he never beat very well because of it and it's been like three years from that point at this point like i never beat it and i kind of want to but like now if i load up my save i don't remember even the controls so it's gonna be difficult for, to, for that to happen all right, Dad, the sun. I think we're ready. Sorry, I hit the mic. Kitty, there's no turning back after this. You sure you're ready? Actually, let me save first. Let me save first, and then let's venture into the unknown. Oh, Kitty, yes, we're ready. Let's go. I'm ready. Okay, I'll watch Haruka for you. Don't worry about her. Thanks, Dad, the sun. I know she's in good hands. I like that day. Is good. Oh, oh, a scripted dungeon sequence. The jungle one. Okay, let's do it. Oh, that's cool. Jungle one. I like this song. It's a good song. Tiger drop. Tiger drop. I miss. Didn't mean to do that, but sure, I'll take it. I want a tire drop, but it's always like a game of like waiting. I never want to do that. I'm impatient. Here, he's already dead. Come on, man. Chill. Counter. He's dead. One guy left. Oh, 
Tiger drop. I think that was a grab, so I can tiger drop grabs. Let's go. Now wire. What the fuck did they do to the city? <laughs> Punch the walls off. Okay. Drum kick! <sighs> I missed. I'm sorry. Whoa. Oh, that's really bad. <laughs> That guy had one HP too. Like, why did we do that? He's dead. He's already dead. Like, stop, Kyria. It's fine. Okay. Dagger drop. This, a grenade? Oh, there's a guy with a gun. Sorry, I need to be careful of him. There's a guy with a shotgun too, actually. It's dead. Okay, we're good. I'm actually pretty low on HP. Let me get a stamina. We get another guy? Yeah. Pin one. How do you miss that? Counter. Wow, that was really good. Just a bunch of fucking weapons just laying around. I'm gonna double X. Okay. Oh, it's not here. I'm sorry. I'm very stupid. What is this? Iron Club. Wait. A po oh, yeah. Champy, I don't know if you're still here, but I'm about to do something really cool. Serious franchise. Well, you again, again. Keep going. No reason to stop. Die. I'm still here. It's okay. Do you see that? I can do it again. Actually, you've probably seen it before. I don't know if you've seen it before. Sorry, not the knife. I don't need the knife. I need. I didn't need that either. There we go. This part. Yeah? 
Yeah, because it's a serious crime drama. Okay. First time seeing this. Nice. Yeah, there's a there's a move where I just fucking insert the pole inside a dude's ass. <laughs> okay, it's fine. That didn't die your drop though. Interesting. Come on. Attack, please. I'm waiting. Fuck it. Die. Can I have a cool item to do like a cool finisher on him? What replaces us with like knuckles, crowbar? Let's just go with a sword. Fuck it. Wait, do I have a? I have a. I I have an iron spear. Okay, so never mind. This is gonna come in handy. Then. Okay, essence of lot to spear. Yeah. Get him with the spear. Oh, cool. Yeah, the flip is kind of cool. All right, sure. Back to fists. Okay, there we go. Who else? Wait, there's a guy holding a fucking bike. Who the fuck does he think he is? Me? There's a guy with a rocket launcher! Okay, let's focus on him first. There's two guys with rocket launchers. Okay. Let's, uh... Let's be careful about that. Oh, my God. Wake up. They blew each other up. There's three guys with rocket launchers. Die. Cool. Damn it, I can't use the rocket launcher myself. That would have been cool. Okay, I can use a stun gun though. Die. That man's dead. That man is dead. Okay, um. Can I do it again? Please? Yeah, sure. Jesus. Dead. Fuck it, die. There we go. Okay. This is a very interesting dungeon sequence. It's just run around town. We're right there. There's probably gonna be another another group of people I need to fight here. Yeah. They're gatekeeping. Okay. You and Yang, okay. Stand up. Damn it, I missed. What is this? A can. Yeah, I don't need a can. Wait, what's this? An item? Nourishment of the sea can. Here you, you okay? Okay. I'm gonna tiger drop that. <laughs> Get the other guy, yeah. Tiger drop instantaneously trigger this quick time event. Take him a little bit. Yeah. Oh, both of them are in red heat mode or whatever. Counter. Dead. One left. Tiger drop. Try again. <laughs> he's he's straggling on the bar. Counter. 
dead. I love the amount of counters the Kiryu gets. I like counters. As a concept, I like counters. Okay. We got the camera. Oh, okay! We're just having a Magma Construction segment here. It would be awesome if Magma showed up just to help. What's this? Oh, that was a good attack. Damn dead. Oh, there's a guy with a gun. There's a couple guys with guns. Whoa, what's this move? Never done that before. That's cool. Oh, I have a gun myself. Die. I don't know if I shot the gun. Let me try again. Yeah, I didn't. Die. Sword. Oh, this guy also has a gun. There we go. There's a guy with a shotgun. Dodge. Okay, he's dead. Okay, there's a glove. Dead. Not dead. Dead. I miss. Sorry, but hello. Hi, Kukichi. You don't have to come and watch this. It's okay. But hello, welcome in. Oh god, more? Okay, sure. I believe it. Okay, inventory. Um, I need a little bit of this. Oh, there's a guy with a grenade. Okay, cool. Oh no, this is not the guy with a grenade. <laughs> Uh, okay, two and one. Where's the grenade guy? Where is he? Is it this guy? No. Is it this fucking guy? Maybe not. Where's Shanty? Thanks for making that drawing. I saw the... I saw the Chiaki drawing. I really liked it. Hi, hi for dish. Why is everyone popping in now? What's happening? What are we doing? That was the guy with the grenade. There's a couple of grenades, actually. Eat. Run. Blow up. Perish. There's more grenades. Another one. Run. Okay, there we go. That guy didn't need a hit move. He was already dying. He was on 1 HP. Okay. Couple down. Okay. He died, okay. Let's go. This looks so good. 
Oh, hey, that was it. Oh, this is so cool. Man in black. Ah! I'm gonna just gonna tiger drop him over and over. Please stand up. Tiger drop. Come on. Tiger drop. Come on, you can do better than that. How long is this gonna go for? <laughs> there we go. Good attempt. Try harder next time. Okay, there goes my hyper good mode. Yeah, I'm not gonna fuck around with that guy. <laughs> now that my hyper mode went away. Let me just drink this. There we go. Damn it. Tag drop. That's the best move in the game, by the way. But it's a counter. I need to land it when he's attacking. So that's what I'm doing. That's why I'm waiting. I missed. Mm -hmm. Come. I missed. Doesn't count. Tiger drop. There we go. Um, that was bad. I don't long health again. <laughs> I mean, the, I mean, the quickest way to do this is to just drink this, get full heat, press this button, and now tiger dropping is way easier. Because I don't get staggered by attacks. Oh, never mind. Special finisher. Let's go! Die, man in black. Are we just gonna throw him off the fucking... Off the fucking elevator? Okay, knee to the face. It's the same as the previous one. It's okay. Man in black defeated. Okay. Um... Hi, why is there a shop here? Final battle. Uh, this is the game just telling you, hey, this is the final boss. Here's a shop if you need anything. Okay. Thank you. Yo, I have a lot of experience. I don't know if I'm going to need any of these. What I could get is this. Damn it, I don't have enough green experience. And nothing I can get will actually help here. Well, what do you sell, buddy? It's just on the phone, just chilling. Black market dealer. It's a bit of expensive, but I'll show you what I got it up. Well, take a look. Yep, killing items. Let me get a couple of these. Let me get uh, one of these. Five of these. Thank you. Demon Blade Myogetsu. Kind of want that. Had enough? See ya. Okay, let me save one of the random shits that I got on in my inventory and get that demon blade or whatever. That sounds like fun. Mm -hmm. Oh, by the way, I should heal up. There's no reason not to heal up. It sells me a couple of these, so... Let me get that. Fight again. And then the demon blade Mew get too. I mean, is that blade, like, good at all? A spear, a saw, and the katana. Let me get the demon blade. Where's the demon blade? Burns enemies? Oh, that's kind of rad. I didn't even gonna lie, that's kind of rad. Alright, this is the final boss fight. Let me save the game real quick. I think this is the final boss fight. That This looks like a boss fountain. Alright, let's go. Goodbye, black market dealer man.